LaTecna. You can visit us on the web at latecna.com. Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Techno Video. Today on the Techno Video, we're taking a look at Photoshop Elements 7 from Adobe, the newest version of Photoshop Elements. We're going to do the overview here of Photoshop Elements, just a quick look at it to see what some of the new features and just um, the new style is of Elements. The first thing you're going to notice is how it how it looks. Um, most of the uh, new Adobe products are starting to look like this, a very simple look. And um, so it's, I, I find it pretty easy to use. But let's get into elements here. So basically you'll have, just like a bridge, you'll have a list of all the photos and albums and stuff like that. So you can click on them to edit them and fix them up. So let's go ahead and try it with this picture. So we double click it, enlarges the photo. Um, the first thing you'll notice up here is the undo and redo button. Also, you have the display button. Um, you can uh, do different displays for the photos, like viewing the photo in full screen. Also, the editor. You have a quick fix, a full editor, and guided editor. Um, that's for like if you really want to simply do it, um, or if you don't know how to do any of this, you can do a guided editor or full editor, which is closer to Photoshop. Obviously, not that close, but it's uh, better. Uh, much cheaper. Um, you can also add captions and stars to your photo. Under the Organize tab, they have uh, four tabs. Under the Organize tab, you can um, add it to different albums and a list of all the albums so you can see. And you can also tag it with sample tags such as people, places, events, and others. The next one is the Fix button, which allows you to simply just click a button and it will auto fix it for you. And you can also go to, um, when you go to the editor, you can go to a full edit, and that will pull open the full editor workspace, um, which is a lot more like Photoshop. And we'll show you here in a second. Okay, here is the full um, version of it with the full thing. It's a lot more, as you can tell, as I said, uh, Photoshop, you can add text, and you also have your magic wand tools and your brush tools and all sorts of uh, tools similar to Photoshop. Um, and then you also have your effects tools over here, which is really nice, and of course the layers, which is very important in your full editing. So we're back to here. And then you have the next tab, which is the Create tab. This allows you to create different things like CDs, photo albums, calendars, slideshows, etc. Um, it's pretty simple to use, and um, obviously that's what the Elements is. And the next one over, and the last one, is Share. This allows you to share it online, on the email, uh, in photos, print, uh, CD, or DVD. It's really uh, pretty simple. Overall, we enjoyed Photoshop Elements as a product. Um, the $90 price tag was not too bad for what it comes with, and it was definitely a big improvement um, over the last one. So we think you would definitely enjoy it if you are a beginner in photo editing or um, want to really easily do that uh, slideshow or that CD or DVD, um, and you just want to easily uh, produce them and give them out. It's a pretty good product. So from the Techno Video and the Techno.com, see you next time.